Okay, I want to do a quick tutorial on InDesign step and repeat feature. It's under the edit menu. And first I have to do something for it to repeat. So I'm going to draw a little square. Say you want to create a pattern out of squares. And um, fill it with a color. Let's see. Pink. I like pink. Now, um, instead of duplicating the square over and over again, which I could do if I grab my selection tool and then hold Alt on my keyboard. Whoops, not that one. Um, and just drag and make copies like so. And then align them and distribute them, whatever. Um, that's one way to do it. However, there's a faster way. So let me go back in time to my one square and then go to edit, step, and repeat. Where are you? There you are. Okay, there's a shortcut for it, but I don't I don't use it often enough to memorize it. Um, okay, so I was just messing around with this. And make sure your preview menu is on. Let me set everything back to zero. And also, here we go. So there's a create a grid option, which um, is pretty cool. So right now I have one count. You know, you can duplicate the square as many times as you want. So I hit preview. Now it won't, you won't see it unless you create an offset. So, or a grid. So first I want to create an offset. So I'm offsetting the five squares vertically. You can also offset them horizontally like so. Um, let's see, five and five inches. You can also create a grid. So you can have more than one column, etc., etc. It's pretty cool. And that's pretty much my tutorial.